Hello guys, in this video I explain to you how to add PLC and HMI in TIA portal basic programming for the beginners. Double click on TIA portal. Now you create a new project. So click on new project icon. Here you write project name I given here the name motor on click on create button click on configure a device Click on add a new device. Here, click on controller. Click on this left arrow of S7-1500. Click on CPU. Click on this CPU-1515-2. Select this last one. 6 ES715 and click on add button now remove this check from the checkbox click on next button also remove this check also click on next here you have to give full access and click on next read this summary and finish now click on this ethernet and in properties you find here ethernet, addr ethernet address click on add new subnet and click on this network view here you will find this pn slash i underscore now you have to click on add new device now select this hmi screen and click on semantic comfort panel here you select the 7 inch display and click on this 700 comfort screen and you select this screen and click on OK. Now here you browse select this PLC1 underscore and click on this checkbox now you see this link for this HMI with this PLC is up here now click on next button just click on next again same click on for this other one. for screen also click on next system screens also next and finish uh, click on this down arrow remove this unnecessary text select this and delete also delete this screen uh, now scroll up click on this program blocks click on main OB1 you see the blue screen is appearing here on this tab down now create your first program select this line and double click on this normally open contact 
and again click on this line click on this normally close contact and this output contact now here you click on this vertical line click on this right arrow click this normally open contact and select this arrows and click on this up arrow and here click on Q0.0 for this output now M hundred point zero. Okay, yeah. M one hundred point one. Now click on this tag to right click here. Give the rename it. Start push button. Click on change. Here, click on this tag. Three. Rename it also. Give it to the name. Click on this change. Here. Rename as motor on. Click on change. copy and select this and paste here now select this root screen and you select this push button another push button you drag here Select this circle and drag here in the center. This we use for motor display. Now click here and select this text. You write here start push button. This one is stop push button. And now here you right click on this start push button go to the properties here you go to the events click on place and here add function here add function you write set bit when you write set bit you will find three options select this set bit white key placed and click this here click on this three dotted button here PLC tag click on default tags here you will find start push button just click and click on this check button now go to the animation here you can click on display click on add new animation click on or you click, double click on this add new and here you click on appearance click on OK button here you click on this three dot button select this start push button and click on check button and here you find a new add new double click this zero option you click double click on new option and here you click the color to select green color 
and then come out from this screen down arrow select this push button stop property events uh, here you click on press and add functions here again select set bit here, third option set bit while pressed and now click on this yellow line click on these three dots here you select the stop push button and click on this check this is stop button is selected click on animation click on display add new animation double click click on appearance click on ok button here you click on this uh, three dot button click on the stop push button again click on check and now click on add new click on one and here you click red and now click on this circle right click property same thing here here you will find display add new animation appearance ok and click on this three dot button click on motor on click on check and now click on this down arrow add new double again click on add new here you click the green color and come out from this screen now what you have to do just click on uh, select this click on PLC click on simulation start simulation this will also compile your PLC program click on OK button now simulation screen is to be appear wait few second more now here you click on this down arrow select this pn i underscore one click on start search button now click on load button here you consider as a trusted this compiling for this later diagram which we created is start it now you click on load button again now you click on this white screen no action here you will down arrow start module and finish now same you have to reduce this screen for the cement simulator and select this HMI underscore one in this project tree and click on simulation now this screen is open reduce this first you have to go to online and after here click on monetizing on and off button now here you just press start push button you see motor is running now when you stop this will stop your motor again you try you see green button as you press this turn on and as you soon this place is stop it will go off I'm sure you understand how to configure PLC and HMI and create your program hope to see you in my next video don't forget to subscribe this channel